All right, so my package from Severin Films finally showed up. I, I ordered a lot of movies, but they were having a really good sale <clears throat> and some were like as low as like $5. So like, I couldn't really say no to that, but I'm very excited to open this up. There's a lot of cool stuff in here. And uh, yeah, let's, let's see what we got. opening skills. Oh boy, mac and peanuts. All right, what's on top? All right, wax mask. Uh, this is a Dario Argento, I believe he, did he produce this or direct it? Uh, he produced it. Uh, I actually watched this on Shudder a while back and it's this is a really, really cool movie. Um, I definitely recommend it, wax mask. But then again, it's produced by Argento, and like I said in my last video, I'm a big Argento fan, so I always try to grab all of his movies whenever they're out on Blu-ray, but I waited a little too long on that one. Um, and here's, uh, here's two that I'm pretty, pretty stoked to check out. So everyone always raves about Jess Franco. Uh, everyone loves his movies. I personally have never seen any of his movies, but I know these are his two biggest films. Um, Vampire, it was Lasbos, sorry for the glare, and uh, she killed in ecstasy. This. So, um, I'm very excited to check these out, and I, I love the way these are like laid out, like the little like, cut out and the slip and everything. They look really cool. So, very stoked on these. Um, okay, here we go. The Attic Expeditions. This was one of Severin's Black Friday titles. Um, I know they were selling a couple of them for like, only like during the sale, like for four days and then they weren't up anymore. So I don't know if this is still up or not. Cause I know they like re like put up some standard editions of the Blu-ray titles. But um, I'm surprised it didn't catch my attention sooner. Cause it has Jeffrey Combs who played Herbert Weston Reanimator, Seth Green, Ted Raimi. Um, it has like a, Alice Cooper is in this. Um, and I watched the trailer and it looks wild. It looks so good. So I'm really excited to do uh, watch this and I'm also kind of mad at myself for not knowing about this movie prior to this sale. So thanks Severin. Queen of Blood. Uh, I think this is one of the five dollar titles. I don't know anything about it but I don't know. It looks cool. So um, yeah so I'll watch it at some point. Um, Horrors of Spider Island. Um, this is from 1960. It's a black and white movie. I love black and white movies. Um, all for classic horror. Um, and I like spiders. So <laughs> this seems like a must have, of course. So yeah, I'm excited to check this out. And then here we go. Killer Crocodile and Killer Crocodile 2 comes together in this package. Um, I mean, it's pretty much exactly what it says, but I love killer animal movies. You know, you really can't go wrong with them. Cyberbranch has a movie out called Wild Beast, and uh, that, another killer animal movie, and it's insane, and I love it. So if you're on their site, get that one too. But this is Killer Crocodile. You know, I don't know, but a crocodile that kills people. And there's two movies here, so this will be fun to uh, hang out and watch one night. Castle of the Creeping Flesh. Uh, I don't know much about this one, but this is one of the Black Friday titles as well. I know it's some sort of like gothic horror movie. I don't know, kind of giving me some sort of like House on Haunted Hill, Vincent Price kind of vibes. So, I mean, I know he's not in it, but kind of has that feel of something he would do. Um, so yeah, I'm excited to check this one out. Something new. Plague Town, another Black Friday title. Um, I don't know anything about it, but you know, whatever. I I will check it out and hopefully it's good. Uh, the back says 
a real horror classic in graphic scenes are reminiscent to a reminiscent of the transgressive 1970s when Wes Craven and Lucio Fulci were discovering new ways to violate the human body. All right, I'm in. This should be a good one. That's exciting. <clears throat> the Theater Bazaar. This was like the big title for Severn this year. Uh, this is like an anthology film. Um, I know that like Richard Stanley, Tom Savini, uh, who else? Kareem Hussein, David Gregory, Buddy Gio, Vianazzo, and Douglas Buck all directed shorts in this movie. I watched this on Shudder a while back, and I remember it being really, really cool, and I really enjoyed it. So I'm definitely excited to check this one out. Um, yeah. Yeah, I remember really enjoying it. So I'm glad I finally got, like, a really cool, like, Blu-ray release. I know there was, like, I know it was out, I think, under, like, a, I think they got another Blu-ray release, but this is, like, you know, definitely the better version of that. So I'm glad I didn't pick that up and I waited. Um, what is this? Byleth, the demon of incest. <laughs> the ultra rare Italio Shocker, Italo Shocker on Blu ray for the first time ever. Apparently, I can't talk today. Um, yeah, I don't really know anything about this, but it sounds bizarre. So, yeah, excited to check that out. The Beast in Heat. I don't. <laughs> I heard this is like a bizarre, very bizarre movie. Um, the world Blu-ray premiere of the most bizarre Nazi exploitation shocker ever. Hard and nasty stuff for those who appreciate the kind of depravity that only Italy could produce in the sadistic 70s. Yeah, I heard this is like pretty wild and like, I don't know if uh, fucked up is necessarily the right term, but <laughs> yeah, I just heard crazy things about this one, so. Definitely kind of one of the first ones I check out for sure. The Strange Vice of Miss Ward. Um, it's a Jallo, Sergio Martino. Um, I actually watched this on Shudder not too long ago too, and I really, really enjoyed it. Nothing amazing, but you know, it's a Jallo and I like Giallos, so it was cool. It was definitely enjoyable. Um, definitely would like to watch it again, so yeah. Now I, now I have it. Paganini Horror. Um, I don't really know much about this one, but I, 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 when Severin first released this, I don't know why I didn't get this sooner, but this cover just kind of like enticed me. I thought it was really, really cool. Um, has, it reminds me of like uh, opera from Dario Argento. So I don't know if it's that kind of like sort of movie and Donald Pleasance is in it and anything he's in is always good so definitely excited to finally check this one out it's been on like my list for a while to purchase werewolf in a girl's dormitory um I love werewolf movies American Werewolf in London the howling dog soldiers wolf cop all that um so anything werewolves count me in uh so this looked really cool and I'm very excited to check this one out. And just the last one. Yeah, just the last one. The Other World. Um, yeah, this is, I, I, I don't think this is necessarily a horror movie, but I know it's Richard Stanley, director of Hardware, and he did one of the shorts in Theater Bazaar. Um, it's about like an area and like, it's like a documentary. I don't know if it's like a documentary, like a found footage kind of thing. I don't know. I don't really know about it, but it seems interesting from what I've like read. So it's uh, you know, it's about an area in France that um, carries a lot of, like magic and supernatural things, and uh, kind of goes exploring that area in this movie. So it seemed pretty fascinating, and uh, I don't know if I missed any, but whatever. Uh, this was another one of the clear out ones for like five bucks, so grab that as well um but yeah so those are all the movies i bought from severin um may have already done it this time but it's fine <laughs> like i said the sales are really good so it's hard to pass up plus they had the black friday titles that i wanted to grab before they weren't available anymore um but yeah if there's anything in this in this stack that i mentioned that you'd like to see me review individually let me know and i will 
I'm probably gonna do a review on the Attic Expeditions. I'm very excited about that one. So, yeah. Um, hope you enjoyed the video. And if you need movies to watch, you can watch this video, my last video. If you need some ideas of stuff, you can check out. And uh, yeah, hope you guys had a good holiday.